was to align three different service lines in the hospital. The hospital already had cath labs, they already had non-invasive cardiology services, they already had bronchoscopy and endoscopy, but this is the first time that patients can go to one place, one waiting room, one check-in counter to um, access all three service lines. A big part of our pre-planning for this job was understanding what was in the existing hospital. We took advantage of virtual design and construction, which is basically building the building virtually in a computer before you actually build it on site. It's very different looking at something on paper and seeing you know, mock-ups that may have sticky notes or cardboard. You plan and you plan and you execute the plan. That's how you do it. <laughs> As the project moved from design into construction, you know, you're bumping up against all kinds of existing conditions. Operating rooms right above you, the emergency department right below you, and it's sandwiched in between. So logistically challenging to get in there and get that project done. Either noise or vibration, you know, we had to be cognizant to their operations and it really kind of changed the way that we planned the work. Healthcare projects are definitely different. It's like you're working in someone's house. They're there all the time. They have critical patients. They have visitors that are maybe distraught visiting their loved ones. So we need to be invisible. Our behavior inside these facilities needs to be different. Joris, obviously, they've done work at this hospital before, and they have all the local relationships. Jay Dunn brings large healthcare project experience. So from the beginning, our team really gelled. I think we've learned from each other. You know, there, there have been challenges, but there are always challenges with joint ventures and partnerships. So far, it's worked out great. To be able to complete that project in that location is just a great testament to the entire team. UHS, Marmon Mock, and the George J.D. Dunn team. I hold the construction team in the highest regard. Their eye was on little detail, but it was also looking forward and running towards big problems. Healthcare projects are very rewarding, and sometimes they're very close to home. You know, if you've been in a situation or you've had a family member with a cardiac issue and you're building a cardiac hospital. I mean, it means a lot to do that. It does kind of you know, reassure that reason why we get up every day to do what we do. What does it for me is knowing that the guy who comes in to have a procedure, he doesn't have anybody to hold his shoes and his pants while he's in there. We provided a place for him to put his shoes and his pants. Knowing that he will receive quality care in a way that affords him dignity that is what really amazes me. You work through the projects and they're all concrete and steel and everything else, but at the end of the day, it's uh, delivering for the client, delivering for the community.